What's up guys and welcome to another episode here on NRV Outdoors. Today we're here at one of our favorite little creeks that was stocked a couple days ago. And uh, this place has been absolutely hammered guys. Tons of foot traffic down there. And a lot of you guys have been enjoying those Nico videos. So I thought I'd bring you another one today. And this bait is just perfect for this situation guys. In today's video we have got the Nico Daffy Wax Worms. These are a super soft, as it says, they're ultra soft, soft plastic. That is in the shape of a wax worm. That's just beautifully scented, very flexible guys, very durable. And I have a feeling it's gonna absolutely slay the fish in here today. We've got a really big windstorm that blew in, blowing in the cold front. And if you look there on the surface of the water guys, there's all kinds of debris floating along. And I think this little bait will be perfect as it represents a lot of small larvae that are hatching out this time of year, blowing out of the trees and ending up in the water for the trout to feed on. So let's go ahead and get rigged up guys and let's have some fun. All right, for our rig today guys, we're gonna rig up a little black painted trout magnet, 164 ounce jig hook. We're gonna fish it under a float for a little while, maybe do some jigging. But I think that black color is gonna represent a perfect larva head as they're often black and we're gonna be able to catch them really good on this little bait. So let's just reach on in here, guys, and I'll show you what these little baits look like. You just reach into your package, and Nico will send you a hard little oyster shell type casing here, guys. And as you can see, just some beautiful little wax worms in there, guys. They're really good scented. They smell just like a wax worm or a little butter worm. And uh, I'd like to show you guys, they are super, super stretchy very very pliable almost sticky and that daffy on the package there actually stands for larva and uh, they're very larva based and all we're going to do guys is rig it up onto the hook this is a very durable plastic so you kind of got to be patient rig it up poke it out and just point it back out of there straight guys and that's it that should be one deadly presentation let's just hope there's a few left to get in here and catch Got him on right there, guys, right in front of us. He absolutely smacked that old wax worm by Nico, guys. Heck yeah. Fighting super hard. Grab our old net out of here. Little slide right on down here and net that little beauty up. There we go, guys. Heck yeah. There's fish number one of our day. Oh, he's still so angry. See if we can't pop that little booger right on off of there. And we'll just let him go back right there. Heck yeah, guys, there's fish number one. Our bait's in perfect condition. We'll give it a bit of a stretch there. And we'll just drop him right on back in here. Hopefully, we found the area where they're laying. We can go to catching them right here, guys. Let's just see what happens. Looks like that's gonna be a little bit too deep. Might be the key today, guys, is finding that perfect depth for these fish. There's a lot of boot tracks in here. Some dough bait containers and whatnot, so may not be too many left, but these little Nico baits have just been shining on those hard conditions, guys, where the fish are really pressured. Just like that, it's really been working for us, guys. The super soft material these baits are made of with that sin added, it's just a winner, guys. We have just been getting it done on these really stubborn fisheries here lately. Let's go on ahead and slide that little beauty in the net. There we go. And there's a gorgeous fish number two on that little Nico wax worm, guys. Pegged right in the roof of the mouth, right where you want it. Just a gorgeous little rainbow trout there, guys. Heck yeah. Let's just let her swim on back in there. We'll check our bait really quickly. Odds are we're going to be in perfect condition. Yep, as to be expected. Give that old bait a nice stretch there, guys. Make sure it's in good shape. Let's just bomb it back in there. Oh, we just had one rise right here, guys. Let's drop it in there on him. He was right there. Oh, he bit it immediately. We got him nicer fish too oh he jumped in kicked us off that little stinker 
that's all right though we got to watch him rise and he absolutely crushed it wow 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 let's just see if he ain't got a buddy in there he very well may let's just drop one right in this little current seam right here guys that's where our first fish came from haven't had any bites from right there since but there could be a couple more hanging out right there seems like this hole got pretty pressured we were able to find a couple pretty quickly there and i feel like as long as we take our time guys we fish this hole thoroughly we can trick these leftover fish they just don't want to bite we should be able to get them in the net got him there we go just like that just like that guys stay impatient with him oh he's angry you can tell he's been in this cool water for a little while full of energy heck yeah guys just working this old nico wax worm through here nice and slow and these little rainbows are coming over and getting for us not a whole lot of fish in the hole but looks like we're catching the ones that are left behind here he's actually been caught you can see there in the jaw he's got a tear right there that's from somebody else's hook they caught him and let him go let's just release him right there to go back with his buddies heck yeah guys check on our little bait here that's four fish hooked and three in the net and uh looks perfect so let's just go on ahead and drop it back in here drag that sucker right on into that current right there flying a couple twitches here and there oh there was our bite he dropped it come back oh these fish are so pressured got him he came back for it heck yeah guys heck yeah another beautiful trout on them old nico soft plastics fantastic Alrighty, let's just slide her right on in there. There we go. Oh, hook popped off as soon as she hit the net. Gorgeous fish right there, guys. Let's just let her go as well. Heck yeah, fish number four. Bait's in perfect shape. Let's get back in there again. There we go, we got him. Oh, big jump right there, wow. Oh, that fish is angry. That fish is angry, wow, wow, wow heck yeah guys heck yeah seen this one rise over there i thought it was a little bit bigger than this and this may not even be the fish we've seen but seen one rise made that cast and came right on over and got it that little daffy wax worm is getting it done for us guys just slaying these old fish still fighting in the net angry 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 little girl right here there we go Let's just let her take off with her buddies. Well, guys, we showed up and thought the hole was pretty well fished out, but it would appear using those Nico products, giving that nice material a stretch, recharging up that scent, and bombing cast out here, guys. We're still getting it done. Heck yeah. Got him on just like that wow guys did not even impart any jigging action it just came over and got it second that thing hit the bottom it was already on there guys heck yeah heck yeah guys it's pretty safe to say these little dappy wax worms will absolutely slay the little stalker rainbows even when they've had some time to get pressured and to get stubborn they'll still come over and get it once again guys that really lifelike look it's got that texture that very squishy texture and then that added scent it's just lights out guys heck yeah let's let that little beauty go heck yeah guys that is just too much fun got him got him on guys jigging that little daffy wax worm heck yeah i think this will be our very last fish of the day 
as I've been standing here, I've seen several anglers walk by wanting to get down in this hole. And honestly, guys, we're just catching and releasing today. So we don't want to stop anybody from enjoying these fish as well, especially those who are going to take them home for dinner. So I think this will be our very last fish right here. We caught them under the float. We caught them jigging. Caught that one on just a dead stick presentation. Didn't have to do anything. And uh, it's just been working for us, guys. This little booger right here has got it super good. Calm down. We're going to set you free. All right, he got that little puppy popped off. Let's just let her go. Heck yeah, guys. Heck yeah. That little bait held up for us beautifully. It's still 100% intact, ready to catch a fish, guys. Just one fantastic little lure right there. And if you would like to get yourself some of these guys, I'm gonna leave a link in the description for you to head down there. Click that link, use promo code NRV10 to save 10% off your purchase. And I'm telling you guys, you will not be disappointed with that little worm right there. It's an absolute fish catcher. If you enjoyed this video, guys, make sure you smash that like button and leave me a comment down below. And let me know what one of your favorite soft plastics are that you can add onto your trout magnet hook. We get out if you can, guys. Do some fishing and have some fun. And most importantly, be safe and tight lines.